Our number one asset is obviously our children, the students of Nanuet. Investing in our children is like investing in the future. Keeping our schools modernized and up to date, safe for our children is what's going to help them succeed and thrive as 21st century learners. The last time we bonded for capital improvements was back in 2002. So nearly 20 years later, we're at the point where we're ready to retire this bond. All of these improvements will make Nanuet a more desirable place to live, work, and raise a family. An important part of this bond is that we are respecting the academic side of how we serve children, but also the physical side of coming to our schools each day. Adding the vestibules will enhance safety for all of our students, all of our staff members, and also importantly, the community members that come to visit us each and every day. And having vestibules will assure everyone that we're doing it in the safest possible way. Safety and security is always of the utmost importance here at Manuet. So we're gonna be upgrading the alarm systems at Miller School. Just like in your home, the roof is one of the most important focus areas of your investment. To fortify and stabilize the five roofs above each and every school is an essential priority for us. We want all of our staff members and students who are our biggest asset to know that the roofs above their heads are structurally sound. A key component of the investment in the elevator at the high school is so that all students can have access to all programs that exist on all three levels of the high school. The STEM learning is very important to us here in Nanuet. It requires hands-on, getting messy type of learning, learning collaboratively with peers. So because of that, we invested in, a few years back, K through four STEM labs for both the GW Miller students as well as the High View. We want them to continue to build that innovative attention to STEM as they move into our academy and bar middle schools. We want that space to be uh, collaborative, and modernized so that the students can continue that growth and that passion that they started in kindergarten. The science curriculum is evolving all the time. Reflecting that evolution in our classrooms is a critical part of this investment. So doing so for all eight of our science labs at the high school is an important focus for this bond. We spend so much time and energy designing lessons for our students to grow academically, socially, and emotionally. We do not want their physical comfort to get in the way of that learning. Research shows that when kids feel physically comfortable in their classrooms, whether it's cool enough or warm enough in their learning space, that's when they're able to focus on some of the higher order thinking and higher order growth of a learning environment. One area of comfort is obviously the use of our facilities, our toilets and our bathrooms. We're looking in this investment at updating the bathrooms at GW Miller especially. We know with children at that age, they're learning about their own personal hygiene at home with their families. It is essential to support that growth. There's so much excitement around athletics in Nanuet. This town bleeds black and gold for sure. Through the years, we've done a really good job keeping up the tennis courts as best we can. However, they have reached the end of their lifespan and need to be replaced. We want to update the surface so that more and more people can use it for many years to come. Currently, the fields retain a lot of water, becomes unplayable, we need to reschedule games. With turf, there's a lot less maintenance involved. By switching over to a turf field, we're also going to be changing the dimensions of the field. One of the key improvements that we are making is to the track, and that is close to my heart, because all my kids are runners. We are planning to not only extend the straightaway to an eight lane uh, straightaway, but we're going to resurface the entire track. And this is going to enable us to be able to host all those events, the counties, the sectionals, the leagues, the um, championship events that we would love to have at our home in Nanuet here. Replacing the bleachers is going to make a much safer and more enjoyable experience for the spectators. And the more enjoyable we make it, the more comfortable we make it for spectators, the more spectators we'll have, and therefore increased school spirit. The gymnatorium is in a building that's already more than 100 years old, and so if we could restore it and update it and keep it safe and replace the seats, not only can our current students use it, but future generations of students. Right now, um, we are looking at historically low interest rates for the bond, and the state aid is at a, as an all-time high at 56%. These factors, coupled with the retirement of the old bond, will result in no additional new taxes. 
We were able to do that through very thoughtful, strategic, and careful planning of all the improvements that we need to make in our schools. And as a board, we are extremely conscious of our fiscal responsibility to uh, the taxpayers of Nanuet. This bond is going to improve life for our students that are in the schools now, as well as a generation of students and families to come. We're really excited for this opportunity. Let your voice be heard. Come out on Thursday, October 28th, and exercise your right to vote. Go Golden Knights!